Hello viewers, welcome to this exciting video. In this video, we will be looking at the November 2021 Science Paper 1, question B3. Question B3 reads, the following diagram shows how energy flows into and out of a coal-fired power station. The following diagram shows how energy flows into and out of a coal-fired power station. Okay, so this is our power station. So coal, uh, they're saying that 1,000 joules of energy comes from coal and is fed into the first, uh, uh, the boiler room, okay? Where the boiler creates steam, steam turns the turbine, the turbine turns the generator. And during this process, 70 joules of energy is wasted as friction okay so uh, out of the 1070 joules has gone as friction then from here uh we go to the next station which is the cooling tower the cooling tower in the cooling tower there is also energy wasted and they've not mentioned the amount of energy wasted in the cooling tower from the cooling tower uh we go to the transformer and in the transformer 30 joules is wasted in heating the wires. So we can see that uh, there is a lot of energy wasted, wasted, wasted. And after the transformer, only 300 joules of electricity is produced. So we've got so much of this energy waste, 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 and only 300 joules of electricity is being produced. All right, let's now... Uh, go to A. A is saying how much useful electrical energy is produced by the power station. This is very simple because uh, we can see that 1000 joules of coal is fed in and only 300 joules of electricity. I cannot see electricity anywhere else being produced and we only have 300 joules and it is the only useful uh, energy that is being produced. So for this question we're just going to say 300 300 joules of electrical energy is produced uh, then we go to b b is calculate how much energy is wasted from the cooling tower calculate how much energy is wasted from the cooling tower so let's go back and uh, look at uh, this diagram of ours so this 1000 this 1000 joules of energy that is being fed so 1000 is supposed to be equal to 70 joules plus the wasted energy in the cooling tower plus the 300 joules here so 1000 is equal to 70 wasted plus the wasted energy in the cooling tower which in this case we're going to put it as x Okay. we're going to put this as x and uh, plus 30 joules plus the useful 300 joules so here it is just going to be 1000 is equal to 70 plus x plus 30 plus 300 so so we have 1000 1000 is equal to 70 plus x plus 30 plus 300 okay so 70 plus 30 gives us 100 100 plus 300 is 400 so we are going to have 1000 is equal to uh, 400 plus x so this 400 will come this side and it is going to be x is equal to 1000 minus 400. So 1000 minus 400 gives us 600. So the wasted energy is 600 joules. So here this will be 600 joules of energy is wasted in the cooling tower. 600 joules of energy is wasted in the cooling tower. All right we go to C. C, 
is saying calculate the efficiency of the power station in producing electricity calculate the efficiency of the power station in producing electricity okay so efficiency is simply just uh, energy output over energy input yeah efficiency is got energy input uh, energy output over energy input or efficiency is equal to energy in output over energy input multiplied by 100%. That is if you want it to be in percentage. So what we are going to have is that the energy input is equal to uh, 1000 and the energy output, the useful word, is actually 300 joules. So we are going to say that efficiency is equal to 300, 300 joules divided by 1000 joules okay multiplied by 100 percent so the joule and the joule goes this zero and this zero this zero and this zero which will now just give us three over ten and this zero cancels with one of the zeros there so it just gives us three times ten which is thirty so the efficiency is equal to thirty percent this is a very uh, a very inefficient uh, power station though in the real world this may be actually a good a good output so uh, we are going to have our efficiency as 30 percent but if you just use energy output over energy input your answer should be 0 0.3 and it is acceptable okay and it is acceptable it's very acceptable all right Thank you very much. Uh, thanks for watching the video. If you're new to the channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button.